Hey everybody and welcome back to Bar Run Forge. It's Troy and it's another video here. We've got to set up a guillotine tool. Stick around. Now the guillotine tool that we're going to put together uh, is what's, in, what's kind of called a C-frame guillotine tool. And guillotine tools are those types of tools that are extremely helpful in the blacksmith shop. Uh, they come in a bunch of different sizes and shapes and kind of formats. Uh, this particular one is a large uh, C-frame guillotine tool that comes to us from uh, Uncle Buck himself, Steve at Uncle Buck's. And uh, he get, also loaned us the jig to put it together. This is the jig to put it together. So we're here in what's called the Red Barn uh, because we've got good uh, 220 power that uh, we've already been doing a welding project here. We've got, already got the welder here. So we're going to set this all up, put the jig together and uh, weld it together and then demonstrate how a guillotine tool works. Steve has done such a great job setting this guillotine tool up with a jig. Works fantastic. Uh, we take this big massive base plate, sits right back in there, goes to the back. Uh, it's got some stoppers at the bottom. Take the big C-frame, sits right down in there like that. We've already got the bottom. He's already got the bottom made up. So that goes on there and gets welded on, uh, specifically like that. And then we take this piece, these four pieces, uh, assemble them as such. And to space it out, we take one of the guillotine dies with paper, which gives us just enough clearance. And we put that back together and we'll weld that together. And after we've got that welded up, then we weld that to here with another piece of guillotine stock in to keep it all vertical and straight. After we've done that, uh, we'll take these two uh, nuts here, insert them back in here where we want, and then weld those in. What that allows us to do is to screw this bolt out or in to give us a, a stopper. So we can, you know, if we're cutting something at a, a specific distance or doing a fuller at a certain distance, that gives us that stopper. Um, which is a very, very handy thing to do. So we'll get that welded in as well. With the base tacked in, we've got uh, our, our base guillotine or frame uh, into place. It's squared up. We found the center of this piece to the center of the C and we've squared it up. We've attached it with a magnet. So now we're just going to put the tacks in on that base as well. All right, to assemble the top uh, guide, guide I guess you would call it, we'll take these four pieces. Uh, we're gonna set our uh, guillotine tool, our tooling die in there. We use this piece on the side, this piece on the side stood up, and then we'll lay our other piece right over the top, tack those in on the sides, make sure they're good and square, and uh, and we'll weld it up.
All right, with everything uh, assembled, we got the top piece uh, ready to tack into place and the guide uh, all welded together. So we're gonna tack everything, get everything all set, make sure we're good to go, and then throw our uh, beads of weld in. The final piece before we throw all the beads in is the stopper or the spacer, uh, gap spacer. So we're going to weld these uh, two nuts in on both sides and then we'll be able to run uh, that stopper in, in and out fairly easily. So let's do that right now. With the guillotine tool all welded up, we are ready to do some, uh, some forging with it. We've got it all set here on the uh, anvil on hazel, and we've got set up with fuller dies, and uh, we're gonna, we got a stop. We'll show you how that works. So we'll get it hot, we'll put it in here, we'll put a fuller in that, light up the forge, see how it works. Quick fuller, great job, very happy with it. So that is a completed guillotine tool, this C-frame guillotine tool uh, that we got from Uncle Buck, Steve at Uncle Buck's Forge. Uh, man, what a great piece and what a great work he does there. Uh, this is a big, heavy duty uh, guillotine tool. And guillotine tools are a very important tool in the blacksmith shop. It helps with precision in forging. You know, like for instance, on this one with the stop, that makes a big difference because if you're going to put a specific distance in here, that piece right there in itself is a huge help to the blacksmith. Uh, when you're putting a fuller in or, or some other way that you're doing it, you can put a bunch of different dies in here for tenoning and, and uh, for just flattening things out. You can do uh, guillotine tools with butcher dies. You can do fullers, a bunch of different sizes as well. And we actually have, like this one, this is a C-frame guillotine tool, we actually already have um, this guillotine tool, this is a, an A-frame guillotine tool, and we've made it where we can slide it in and out of this to put in the, uh, the vise if we want, or to put a hardy shank on, use it that way. That's one guillotine tool, and then this is what's called a gate guillotine tool, and you can see basically how that works, and you can do different dies here as well. Put a hardy shank on it, and it's adjustable as well. Uh, so guillotine tools are a very useful tool here in the shop. If you have the opportunity to get a guillotine tool for your blacksmith shop, or even if you're doing fabricating, things like that, take advantage of it and get it. If you wanna make one up, fabricate one. Uh, they're not really all that difficult to do. It's just a matter of measuring and making sure uh, everything fits together and moves up and down. So anyway, thank you guys so much for coming in and watching our videos. We appreciate every time you watch our videos here at Bar Run Forge. Check us out on all those social media. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Hit that reminder bell so you're reminded every single time we have a video coming out. Take care, guys. God bless. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Check one, two.
And uh, yeah, that was really choppy, sorry. With the guillotine tool fully, <laughs> sorry. Tool. <laughs> My brain. I got skew. Kenny, I got skew. Skew. With the guillotine tool, all four, <laughs> it makes it almost foolproof on how to put this together. We'll see if we can't screw it up, okay? And then we take this massive piece here, <laughs> the C-frame, and uh, it literally just slides back in here until it makes it almost foolproof. It seats up, it makes it almost foolproof. Down in the bottom, it's foolproof. All right, the final piece, <laughs> Your lip. <laughs> Jesus in on the next one. <laughs>